Hey guys, uh, Susie here, and I thought today I'd kind of do a quick, um, I don't know, follow me around Sunday thing. Um, I don't do a lot of vlogging. If you guys are wanting to see more vlog type videos, leave me some comments. I'll do my best. I don't live the most exciting life or anything, but I will um, try to vlog as much as possible. But I just honestly don't really do a whole lot. Like I go to work and then I, um, you know, come home and I just kind of do the same thing every day. <laughs> I don't really have like any kind of exciting things that go on in my life. Ugh, I'm trying to back out of my driveway and film at the same time. Not a good idea. Um, but anywho, so yeah, I'm not really used to vlogging or really uh, being on camera very much so if I seem like rambly or kind of like disorganized as far as this whole thing goes is Sunday morning and we got up probably about 9 30 10 I made some breakfast and this morning I actually had a egg sandwich um, with cheese and my husband also had an egg sandwich with cheese and turkey bacon on it and we actually had farm fresh eggs because my mom went to the farmer's market here and bought some farm fresh eggs. So we were able to eat those for breakfast. They were delish, really good. You can definitely tell a difference. And now I'm actually kind of just on my way to do a little bit of shopping today. Um, so I'm gonna stop at Marshall's because I'm looking for a pair of black flip-flops. Um, I actually threw away all my flip-flops because they were old and just like funky. <laughs> you know, they don't last forever. They're just flip-flops. So I threw a lot of them away and I currently have zero flip-flops. I only have like really nice um, sandals and things that I've bought at Target and other places. So no flip-flops at all. And some days you just want to wear flip-flops, you know? So I'm heading to Marshall's just to see if they have a good deal on any cute flip-flops. I always see uh, people find really good deals at Marshall's on cute flip-flops. And then actually after that I'm going to go over to Dollar Tree and um, I need to buy a couple things to send out a package on Monday. Um, for those of you who don't know, I did open a Poshmark closet. I don't really have much in there right now, but I have sold one item and I need to ship it out. And Poshmark's pretty cool. I like that, you know, the seller or the buyer, I should say, pays for the shipping. So literally all you do is print out a label, stick it on a package and send it off. And that's all you got to do. It's really nice, super convenient. I like it so this is gonna be a good way for me to get rid of things that I don't wear anymore or that never really fit me good in the first place um, it's not too bad out right now it's been like hotter than Hades but today it's actually kind of nice um, and yeah last night we didn't really do much of anything we just went to Chili's and had a really kind of late dinner about like 9 or 10 o'clock ish um, yeah, and that was about all we really did. I didn't really do much else. Um, and I had to drive last night, which I don't like to do. Um, I am just not very good at driving at night. Honestly, I just don't really like driving anymore, period, because I kind of get, like, pretty bad driving anxiety. Um, I didn't used to be that way, but, like, I don't know what happened. I don't know, but it's gotten worse. So, anywho, um, I'm going to go over to Marshall's. If I can film a little in there, I'll try to. Um, I'm not really going to look around too much. I'm really just going to kind of stick with the flip-flops. And I may look at some towels for our bathroom, but that's about it. So, if I can, I will tape while I'm out. And then I will see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so I just got out of Marshall's going into the car. Ugh. 
and um, I tried to film a little in there, but it was kind of hard because there was a lot of people in there today. Um, I did pick up two things. I looked at the towels also, but I just, um, I don't know. I mean, I saw some towels. I was like going to get them, but then I thought, you know, for the same amount of money as these towels, um, I can just get two pairs of shoes. So I just went ahead and picked up two pairs of flip-flops and it's very sunny out and it's starting to get really hot. So let me turn my hair on. So I'll show you guys what I picked up really quick. I just picked up two pairs of shoes. Um, I picked up these. Um, they didn't have any black flip-flops. Sorry guys. They didn't have any black flip-flops that I liked. So I think I'm just going to pick some generic ones up at Dollar Tree. And I got two kind of nice ones in there. So I picked these up. And these are the Roxy brand. They're kind of like a coral color they're really pretty and these are a really nice good kind of sturdy um, material and these were $7.99 so I picked these up because I don't really have any pink shoes so those will come in handy and honestly I feel like they need to be marking all these flip-flops down I'm sorry but all the flip-flops in there need to be starting to get marked down because I mean, think about it. It's already going to be August, and one more month, it's going to be, like, almost fall. So, why on earth are we still charging, like, $19 for flip-flops? You know what I mean? I don't know. That's just my two cents. And then I picked these up, and I saw these for the original price was $19.99. I don't know why these were marked down to $14.99, but I got these white flip-flops, and these are Coach. As you can see there and then they're really cute they have like the coach print on there and then they've got the two little silver things um, they do have some marks on them like somebody wore them in the store or something I'm not really sure I can always just kind of wash these off with some bleach and stuff and they'll be nice and shiny I mean they literally look like somebody like walked around the store in these um, so maybe that's why they marked them down but as you can see, the price on these was only $14 compared to $19. So I was like, you know what? I need a pair of flip, like white flip-flops. So I'm going to go ahead and pick those up. And that's everything I got in Marshalls. I didn't get any towels um, because just didn't really have any towels that I cared for. I don't know. Just didn't really have any. Sorry, guys. I'm like the worst vlogging person ever. So anyway... Now I'm done with that, I'm going to head over to Dollar Tree and I'm going to pick up, um, try to, whew, sorry, my nose is running. I'm going to try to pick up those two flip-flops, um, I mean, I don't even know what I'm talking about. I need to pick up those black flip-flops from Dollar Tree and then I'm going to buy some other stuff in there and hopefully Dollar Tree won't be as crowded so maybe I can try to film some stuff in there, maybe. Anyways, sorry for that rambling craziness. So I am about to go to Dollar Tree. So I'll see you guys when we get there. Open eye through the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in. Hold tight, hold tight, chemicals collide. Hold tight.
Dollar Tree. My phone actually cut out earlier. This is why I don't vlog with my phone very much because I don't know, I'm always running out of space. So, anywho, let's dive in and I can show you guys what I picked up at Dollar Tree. Oh, there's my receipt all stuck to that. So, I picked up one of these um, shipping envelopes. It's the one with the bubble wrap inside. I just picked up one so that I can use this to ship off my um, thing for Poshmark. I picked up two of these and this is the One Smile Teeth Whitening Strips. These are brand new. Um, I know a lot of people tried like the gel or whatever and they did say it did work but it made their teeth really sensitive. Um, so I thought I would try these. I'm not sure if I'm really going to like them. There's three treatments in these. Um, there is um, six total strips. So yeah. I picked up two of these and I'm going to give them a go and try them out. I don't know if I'm really going to like them. I may document it on Instagram so be sure to follow me on there. But it says you just leave these on for 25 minutes and supposedly noticeably whiter teeth in 25 minutes. I really doubt that but they're cheaper than white strips so I'm going to give them a go. I picked up two of these packs of cards. I picked up um, these. These are eight blank note cards and I really like this little design on them. They got a little bird. It's really cute. And I also picked up these here that say thanks. Um, also, these are also going to be for use on my Poshmark stuff. I'm really thinking about opening a boutique and if I do, I definitely want to include a thank you card in each shipment. I picked up this Pure Silk um, Shave Cream. This is the Sensitive Skin and yeah, I, I don't know what this one smells like. Soothing Botanicals with Aloe. That's all it really says. It says Aloe, Papaya, Thyme, Willow, Bark. So, picked up one of these. I picked up this pack of Rawhide Munchie Sticks for Muffin. She might like to chew on these. These are the ones that don't have that dye, so she's not going to get all over the bed and everything. Um, also picked up one of these Bansect Flea and Tip Control for dogs. These only last for like one month, but they're only a dollar, so. I picked up one of these all-purpose hair brushes from the Natural Expressions whatever line. I really like the way this one felt on my hair. I need a new hairbrush in my purse, so picked up one of these. And I also picked up this Refresh Your Car Mixed Berries. I did not like the new car scent. I threw it out because it had a really funky smell to it. So I bought a different one. So I got that one. Um, I got this pack of Red Baron Deep Dish Minis. There's three cheese pizzas in there. That looks really good. I think I'm actually going to eat that for lunch. <laughs> And I also bought these Sunmade Oatmeal Raisin Apple Cookies. These are a favorite of my husband. He loves these things, so I picked up some of those. I also picked up these Good Health Veggie Straws with Sea Salt. These are really good and healthy. I'm going to try to eat these more often because they are good for you. They're just really good. And these are a good one. They don't have no artificial anything. And then I picked up two bags of candy for my office at work um, from the brand Columbina. These are a fun mix and it looks like there's something written in like um, Spanish or something on these. But there's lollipops, hard candies, 
filled candies, bubble gum pops, and chewy candies in this bag. I got some of those. And I also got these original bazooka bubble gum. And I think these actually still come with like the little um, comic or little thing inside that's kind of fun to read. Picked up some of those. And then I picked up two boxes. I got, um, they had Posteroni. I picked up the Posteroni Angel Hair Pasta with Herbs. And these are really good, very good name brand product. And also the Shells and White Cheddar. So those look really good as well. Again, from the Posteroni. Love that. Um, picked up a box of this Hearth Club by Clabber Girl Baking Soda. I'm actually going to start using this when I brush my teeth for cleaning your teeth. They're really, really good. Um, just really good for teeth whitening. So, picked up some of that. Um, I also picked up this, and I don't know if I'm going to like it. It's Bumblebee Sensations Jalapeno Seasoned Tuna with Crackers. I'm not really a fan of spicy foods, but I'm going to give this a go. Um, I do like, I like jalapeno poppers, so I may be able to stand this. I don't know. We'll see. But these were only a dollar there. Really nice. I think I'm going to save this for my lunch tomorrow for work. And then I also picked up this can of Goya chickpeas. I've seen a lot of really good recipes um, making like a chickpea salad, so I think I'm going to make some of that. And also this Progresso Southwestern style corn with potatoes and peppers soup. Always over a dollar, always. So it's good to get it for a dollar. And the last bag here, I picked up some black flip flops. You guys know I was on the hunt for these. These are really good. I like the way these have a more sturdy kind of um, strap or whatever. So these are my size, eight to nine. It's men's, but I think they'll be able to fit. I don't know. I'll have to try them on. Hopefully these fit. They do look a little bit big. I don't know. We'll see. But some black flip flops. Um, I picked up these two packs of stickers. I, I don't know why I keep buying these damn stickers. I don't even do anything with them, really. But these were so cute, I couldn't pass them up. So I picked these up. These are so cute. They have little rainbows and deer and little girls and stuff. It's so cute little fairies. And then this one just has different dogs and cats on it. Really cute. I just, I don't know, I just could not not get these. <laughs> They're so cute for like sending off a friend mail or something. So I had to pick it up. I picked up one of these beauty blenders. Um, they're not bad for being cheap. I don't care for them a lot, but they're better than nothing. And the one I have really needs to be thrown out. So picked up a new one. I picked up two puzzles. Um, these are not the Greenbrier brand. I actually really do not like the Greenbrier brand at all. Um, I don't know, the way their puzzles are, or just like the pieces are cut really funny. So this one is a Majestic Turtle puzzle. It's 500 pieces. And then this one is from the Polaroid brand. It's also a 500 piece um, photo art collection puzzle. So that looks really cool. And this is actually a nice little name brand puzzle. So this one will be kind of fun to do. Um, also, I picked up this t-shirt. I just loved the color of it. It's really just a cute color. Um, it is a size small, but that fits me. I like it. It's a really cute neon coral color. So I could not pass this up. These are really good shirts for a dollar. I mean, they're made with mostly cotton and then some polyester, but yeah, they had different colors. I really, really like the shade of this one. So I picked it up, wear with leggings or something. And then I picked up these two candles. These were new. This one really doesn't have a smell, but I just like the writing on it. It says, you are my sunshine. I don't know if these are old or new. I've never seen them in my Dollar Tree before. They're really cute. And then this one says, follow your dreams, and it is blue. And this one actually does have smell. It smells like vanilla. But I'm just going to use those as decoration anyway. And last but not least, I picked up these little measuring spoon set. 
Uh, mine is really gross and this one looks a lot nicer so I went ahead and picked that up. So that's everything I picked up. I hope you guys enjoyed following me around today and I hope you enjoyed seeing my haul. I hope you guys have a good day as well and I will see you guys in my next video. Be sure to subscribe for more vlog, beauty style, haul, everything videos. Um, and if you guys enjoyed these kind of vlog videos, let me know and I'll try to do more of them. So see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Mwah.